We don't want to fight crime. We want to prevent crime. That's at the end, what you do with this technology. But it's the automation that made the difference, honestly. And the predictive analytics that can tell you, okay, crime is most likely to occur at this time in this place because of machine learning and artificial intelligence. We have a lot of people that come to work, to study, to visit Cora Gables. There was a big need to uh, build a robust and resilient infrastructure that can provide that high capacity, that high speed communication layer to support those services. One of the biggest challenges is not too much to convince stakeholders and leaders of the importance of using technology to achieve their mission more effectively. Is that we need to make sure that we can work together, not in silos, in a coordinated approach where we collaborate, we work in a synergetic way that we are more effective working together. One eureka moment for us was when we realized that after building that infrastructure and that stack of services and communications, we were able to create a common platform where all that value can be aggregated and presented to the residents, to the citizens, and to the stakeholders. We called it the Smart City Hub, where we have all those digital tools. It's like an operating system of a city. It's not an exaggeration, but we had a lot of small projects that made a big impact in, uh, with quick uh, wins and high ROI that were tangible, that the citizens can touch and see. That made a difference. Uh, for example, working with police, we were able to implement smart policing technologies that lower crime more than 40% in just two years using hyper automation and detection capabilities and using actionable insight from data for planning, but also traffic accidents and crashes. Also, that's reduced a lot uh, using this technology. And then we started, for example, counting pedestrians in downtown and looking how traffic was changing and impacting business and impacting urban planning and decision-making over the years, providing that data online, transparent to the public. At this moment, we are finishing a big digital transformation initiative. We are excited because we see how we can make an impact and we can make a difference. Remember, we live in this community. Our families live here. Everything we do, we do for the community. We do for our families too.